Hi friends, welcome back to Calm in the Chaos Homeschool. If you're new here, my name is Daveen and today I have a robotics course giveaway. So stay tuned if you're interested in finding out both about the course and then about how you could possibly win a course for your child to learn how to build and code a robot. So today I'm going to be going over how my daughter, how what she thought of the robotics workshop for kids course that she took. She did the first level of robotics and coding. It was a robot called Robbie. So she built Robbie and then she learned how to code him to do different things. So she participated in three workshops, about one hour long each, and learned how to do all these things in those three hours. When we signed up for the course, she was sent the robotics kit. So I will have an unboxing here. I'm just going to include that clip here so you can see what's inside the kit that you receive if you decide to do this course. Hi everyone. So we got this in the mail. It's the robotics for kids package. So I very ugly opened this because I didn't know what it was. I did not look inside. I realized what it was. And I'm going to have Annika go ahead and go through it since she's the one doing the course. So go ahead. Okay. So. Um, we have this container. Um, and I think it's probably going to be filled with. Okay. Some, okay, so here we have some wires and some cords and some some pieces, some other pieces. Is there a piece of paper that tells you what those things are at the top? Oh yeah, okay. So we have... And then we have a drum. <laughs> I don't know how this is a drum, but it's a drum. Then I assume these are drumsticks. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So are you are you excited about taking this robotics class? Uh, yeah. What are you hoping to learn? Um. Well, maybe just how like how to put things together and um, what it'll turn out to be. Okay, all right, thank you. All right, so that was us opening the box to see what's inside. And then after that, she signed up for her classes. Um, she had it at the same time, once a week for three weeks. And here is me sneaking in a few times just to see how she's doing and what's going on during the classes. So she came out of the first class super excited, bursting to tell us what she had learned. I will definitely say she enjoyed the classes. She was not bored by the one hour length. She was very enthusiastic and involved during the whole time. She learned a lot. She has never created a robot and coded a robot before. She does have some experience with coding just on scratch and stuff, and she really likes that stuff. But she's very fine motor, creative, and detail-oriented person. So I thought that robotics would be a great next step for her. And so she really, really enjoyed it. So I have a little clip here where I'm interviewing her and asking her just some questions about the course. Okay, so here is Annika and she's going to tell us how her course went, 
how she enjoyed the robotics, and then what she made here. So first, tell us about Robbie the robot. Okay, so this is Robbie. Um, so he has um, little LED lights here that coordinate with his movements. So um, the red light turns on when his left arm moves. Um, the yellow light turns on when his head moves, and the green light turns on when his right arm moves. Okay, can we see the back here? You see the back, there's a bunch of cords, and then what is this called in the back here? That's, you know, okay, that's so this part is the memory, and this part is the board. So um, these wires um, are connected to the light, and these wires are connected to the battery pack. Okay. So have you ever made anything like this before? Um, no. Um, when I first saw it, I thought it looked really cool and I wanted to try it out. So it was pretty fun. So I think before this you see the unboxing so you can see all the pieces that it came out in and this is what she created. So what can he do? Show us. Show us what he can do. Okay. Well. <laughs> Can he do anything else or? Um, well, at first, before I put the drumming code in, he could kind of move his arms and his head. Okay. So tell me about the classes that you took online. Um, how many classes did you take? Um, I took three classes. And how long were these classes? Um, they're about an hour. And um, so the first class, we kind of talked about all the parts of the robot and what they do. Um, in the second class, we kind of um, kind of finished putting him together. And in the third class, we learned how to code him. Okay. And how the code works. Okay, so how do you put the code inside of him if I've never done this before? Okay, so um, you would have all your basic code uploaded onto a computer. And um, there's this cord and this cable input that you attach it to and you attach it to your computer and then you can kind of play with the code and experiment with it a little and then upload it. Okay so did you learn how to make him do different things with the coding? Yeah okay. so you can kind of experiment with the different drumming patterns and the light patterns. Okay. So what did you think of the classes overall? Did you enjoy the classes? Do you enjoy the teacher? Do you think it was well presented? Yeah. Um, I think I really like the classes and um, we learned a lot of stuff, so yeah. Okay, so would you do this again? If you Would you want to do the next level yeah. sometime? Yeah, I would. Okay, all right. All right, thank you. <laughs> thank you for sharing with us how You're it welcome. went. So as you can see, this is what she learned and how she enjoyed the course. Um, she's interested in doing the next level at some point, so I'm thinking maybe in the fall we might go ahead and do the next level. Once again, I have said before, I find this course to be super affordable for what it is. If I look in my area, I would probably pay maybe $200 for the same thing in my area. So it's really priced quite reasonably for this type of course, including the kit and then live, live workshops where she can see the teacher and ask questions and interact with other students. So if you think that this is something that you would want for your own child it is for six and up so a six-year-old could do it i would say you probably need to be there with the six-year-old the teacher vanud does recommend that most parents are with their child i wasn't i was working at night so i wasn't able to be there but that being said my daughter like i said is very independent she was ready to do this i wasn't worried about any of the fine motor things and her capability of learning how to do it. She knows more about coding and really coding than I do. So I wasn't worried about her. But if you do have a younger child, it would be suggested that you sit, sit in on the classes. There were other students in her class and they definitely had their parents there. So just depending on your child's age, 
I wouldn't say that even though this is for six years, six years and up, that older children can't do it. He would say between six and 16. My daughter is 11, she's almost 12, and it went well for her as well. So if you're interested in this course, I'm gonna ask you to do a few things to enter the draw to win. And so what you will win is you will win level one, Robbie the Robot with the robotics kit, and then you will be contacted to schedule a workshop time to learn how to code the robot. So if you're interested, please do give this video a like, and I would like you to comment below. Comment, um, just say that you would like to have the course for your child and why, why something like this is interesting to you or what is the most attractive feature in this robotics course to you. So I'm going to actually give you three ways to get um, extra entries. So the first one is to like this, like this video, comment below that you are interested in winning this course and then tell me why. The second way is to go to my Instagram, Common the Chaos Homeschool, my Instagram account, follow me there, find my most recent post about this video, like the comment and, po and comment below that you're interested in winning the robotics kit. And then the third way is to join me in my Facebook group, Common the Chaos Homeschool Facebook group, find the post about this video and the same thing, like and comment that you're interested. So you can get up to three entries if you do those three things. I will leave links to my Instagram and my Facebook group below as well so you can find it easily. And I will be choosing a winner one week from today. So on Wednesday, on the Wednesday after this video goes out, I will be choosing a winner and you can get up to three entries if you do those things. So, so thank you so much for coming today and participating. I hope to see you in my next video. Goodbye, everyone.